Hi, this is Dr. Vivek and in this video, I'll share with you the first symptom of magnesium deficiency. Magnesium is also very important for us, especially if you want to sleep good, if you want to have good mood. For this, we need good magnesium. If it's lacking, then this will cause problems in your sleep. You will not have the sound sleep either. You, your sleep will be disturbed. I mean that you will wake up many times in the night. Your mood will be not good. You will feel depressed. It can even cause the effect on your blood pressure if you are having lack of magnesium in your body. And other problems as asthma, problems with your digestion, these things also occur. Now the question is why does the deficiency happens? What I have seen in my practice, it is not because of the food that you are eating, the food that is not rich in magnesium or any other reason. What I have seen that it happens because you are eating the wrong food. You are eating the food which depletes the magnesium from your body. The junk food, the refined food, lots of sugar, these things will surely decrease the magnesium from our body. And that's why maximum people suffer from the magnesium deficiency. I have seen that if there are 100 people suffering from magnesium deficiency, 60-70% people, the reason is the bad food habits. So if you want to have a good magnesium level in your body, you need to eat right. This is the only way. Now, how we know that we are having low magnesium in our body? The first symptom that you will see is you are tired. You are getting tired very often means you are playing sports or you are doing any kinds of exercises and now you feel tired. This may be because of the magnesium deficiency. Even it can be because of the vitamin D deficiency. The thing is both of them control each other. So if you want to have good magnesium, you should have good vitamin D also. And if you want to have good vitamin D, you should have good magnesium also. So both of them have about the same effect, not in whole, but yes, they balance each other and they have the same effects on our body. So if you want to have good magnesium, then you have to eat right. Even if you are on any kinds of antibiotics or any kinds of diuretics, if you have diabetes, these things also decreases the magnesium in our body. So if you are on any kinds of these medicines or you are having any of the issues, also if you are having IBS, it's irritable bowel syndrome. So in this case also you need magnesium many times the irritable bowel syndrome it is because of the magnesium deficiency also so in these cases you should take extra care of the magnesium in your body see all the times the magnesium levels are not correct when you give an analysis the blood test many times it is and subclinical symptoms so the symptoms are more important over here I hope that this knowledge will help you take care of yourself, try to listen, try to understand your own body. It will help you a lot to be far from all the chemicals. Smile more, don't take stress because stress also decreases and depletes the magnesium from our body. Stay happy, stay healthy.